The antenna system is fed with LMR 400, as you see here leaving the bird 43 watt meter, uh, snaking alongside the back of the workbenches here, and coming out to the point of exit in the cellar, along with uh, an LMR 400 for VHF, UHF work, as well as uh, one dedicated for HF use, and a control cable are going outside via a piece of 4 inch PVC conduit that's all taped up here and protected uh, from the, uh, the cold weather. Uh, that's going through the cellar bulkhead window here to the outside under the deck. As you can see, the 4 inch PVC is coming out of the bulkhead window, uh, coming outside under the deck, and is going uh, right down uh, uh, direct buried, uh, direct buried under the uh, concrete apron here that you see on the, uh, the deck area. And then from the, uh, the concrete area, it's direct buried about uh, 5 feet down. It's going all the way through the yard up in that little clump of trees that you see up in the uh, back part of the lot. It's approximately 120 feet of 4-inch uh, PVC conduit uh, buried out to the edge. Okay, this is the uh, less elegant view of the um, outbuilding here. I just have a temporary installation for HF just to get the, some of the HF rigs uh, tested and demonstrated on the air. Um, we'll forego the view of uh, inside of the, uh, the shack here, but essentially the two pieces of LMR 400 uh, come out of the, uh, the outbuilding that you see here. And again, temporary installations. I just got the, the LMR 400 kind of piled up on the ground here. So that's going up here and feeding a Cushcraft R5 vertical. Just put this up yesterday just to do some of the HF uh, radio testing. And um, it's a modified R5. Uh, it's modified in the sense that it's missing the impedance matching uh, section. Bought that uh, as is at a ham fest for just a few dollars and essentially uh, rigged up a direct feed uh, arrangement uh, temporarily. The LMR 400 is uh, feeding the um, uh, vertical section of the R5. And I've uh, put a couple of um, ground radials uh, at uh, 20 meters, uh, about uh, 16 feet uh, per leg. I put four legs on that, and they're just tied off in trees uh, here and there just to give us a good match for 20 meters and doing the test. So as you see, the antenna is not a real elegant solution. It's their uh, bare minimum just to do some of the, uh, the testing for the uh, HF rigs. Uh, nothing exotic here, so basically what you're hearing in the rigs is the performance of uh, a very modest uh, and simple uh, uh, R5 installation that you see here.